race fans, it's showtime! And get it on, I will, as they come down the front straightaway, as is gonna be Jimmy Phelps leading the field in turn number one. They jam up four wide between one and two. Everybody looking for a racing room here on lap number one, but Jimmy Phelps is trying to run away early. As they head up into the West End for the first circuit, it'll be Jimmy Phelps in the 98H bringing him off the turn as Danny Johnson feeling the pressure as Pat Ward able to grab position number two. Alan Johnson shuffled back to fourth. Billy Dunn in the three RS, he'll ride the low side. He'll be in position number five. Up top, it's still a uh, six-tenths of a second lead for Jimmy Phelps over Danny Johnson. Danny coming up a big win just a few nights ago over the land of Legend Speedway, trying to go back-to-back, -back, which has been a rarity on the tour for anybody else other than Matt Shepard the last couple of years. And Stuart Friesen has been able to pull it off as well as they race their way into turn number one and two. Top Larry White and Matt Shepard locking horn. Now they'll go three wide with Alan Johnson off of turn number four. They split the Hall of Famer as Shepard moves up a spot. He'll bring the 99L of Lightning with him as they exit corner number two. Well, Larry White and Matt Shepard doing what they did here last year, racing side by side down the back straightaway as they're trying to close up on uh, Larry's teammate, Pat Ward. Wide here. Comes Shepard around the 42P of Pat Ward. Oh, we got a good one here. Shepard trying to now work on the, uh, the doctor coming off of the fourth turn, but he drifts high. He might have lost a spot or two. As the doctor shuffled back to fourth, Pat Ward fifth. Right now, as he's got to be patient trying to get around the Rusty Smith number two, because here comes Friesen down the back straightaway as Phelps dive bombs into turn number three. He'll keep the lead around the Z machine with Friesen right there on the top side into turn number three. I think Phelps figured it was now or never on that move. Yeah. Down the front straightaway, Friesen's going to bat the line. Does he have it? Yep, he does, at the line. As he will lead lap number 44, four car number 44. Ford. He's to the outside of Matt Shepard, who was on the back bumper of Pat Ward. So Rudolph, he's been able to show some speed here. He got by Mark Johnson, and now he's working on the 9S of Shepard, and he's got him in turn number one and two. So now he'll look to close on the 42P of Pat Ward as they work onto the back stretch. Roberts, here but here comes Phelps. He's going to go three wide down the front straightaway and get around both Hearn and Roberts into turn number one. So Jimmy Phelps, you, you see the opportunity. You got to take it. Danny Johnson, he's going to try to do the same, but no, Roberts shuts the door on him. Off of corner number two, that's going to cost him some ground. So Phelps continues to lead. Brett Hearn and Adam Roberts down between Phelps and your second place running Danny Johnson. Billy Dunn still there for third. Fourth is Stuart Friesen as pressure now coming to him from the 25 of Rudolph and the 42P of Pat Ward. Oh, seven. And now Friesen goes to the bottom, Rudolph up through the middle. And Rudolph this time again able to pull alongside Friesen on the back straightaway. Side by side, they'll take it to the west end. Rudolph through the middle, drifts up, slides up, looking to catch a little bit of moisture up there on the high side. Friesen stays down low, and as they exit turn number four, Rudolph's got the spot at the line. Wow, it was three wide, coming off a of corner number two. Pat Ward was in the middle, Matt Shepard down low, Stuart Friesen up on the top side. So Friesen again, rim riding it through corners number three and four. Shepard way down low, and Shepard able now to get by the 42P of Pat Ward as they came to the line. So Shepard there for sixth. That puts Ward back to seventh. Stuart Friesen now eighth. We are green and we are racing one more time here in the Freedom Fighter 100. Jimmy Phelps, Danny Johnson, and here comes Matt Shepard immediately off the restart, diving to the inside of Eric Rudolph. Shepard wants to grab the third spot, but he opens the door on the bottom for Billy Dunn, who looks to take the fourth position back, and he'll do so. And Mad Max is on the move. The HBR 6H of McLaughlin gets around Pat Warden. He's rolling through the center of the turn. He's going to go after Shepard for the five spot. He's looking for his 15th career Super Dirt Series win. He brings it off a of turn number four, and Jimmy Phelps will win the Freedom Fighter 100. Danny Johnson second, Eric Rudolph third. Terry, ladies and gentlemen, how about a round of applause? The Baldwinsville Bandit. Jimmy Phelps, the Freedom Fighter 100 victory here tonight.